Hello, hi everyone. This is Sami here from uh, Agronomy Solutions. Welcome to one more blog of Agronomy Solutions. This blog is all about how to control a short hole borer. Other day I had made uh, a video on short hole borer, uh, how to identify it, uh, what are the remedies, and how to how should we control it. Today to control a short hole borer, we are going with the spray. So I just wanted to give you a glimpse what exactly we are using, what contents are we using. So that like uh, you can uh, <coughs> use it at your estate, like if we are wrong you can comment us and tell. So today we are going with one is insecticide chlorophoryphas, we are going with 20% EC of chlorophoryphas. This is we are using <coughs> per barrel 600 ml. So why 20% because most of the people they argue with me this is a very basic dose so I want to go with a basic dose because I don't want to use a higher molecule because I don't want to addict my plants for it so uh, I want to do anything what I do into the very standardized form and a basic form because I don't want to make my agriculture complicated one so coming back to chloro 600 then coming back to a systemic quantoff that is <coughs> quantoff is 5% EC <coughs> Again, most of the people here you can see 5% EC. You can just see here, count of RLs, you can Google it up. So, combination of insecticide and a systemic fungicide, where a systemic fungicide does a job of bandaging the wounded part, where the insecticide gets in and uh, the dieback uh, forms and rakeli damage irate or the shoots get damaged so quantof and <coughs> i mean chloro and quantof uh, it's a good combination because it it does a bandage work and uh, chloro controls the insecticides are like it will make if the insects are inside uh, the tissue it will kills it so now coming back <coughs> here one is quantof and chloro quantof we are going with 500 chloro we are going with 600 then just to add up because today labor is again a big problem just to add up the nutrition management into this cocktail form we are using 19 all 1 kg then a micronutrient brexil plus 200 grams then potassium shonite in the earlier videos also, in earlier blogs also, I have shown you, I have given you the importance of uh, potassium shonite. Potassium shonite helps in a uh, lot of forms because uh, there are the three elements in it which will, uh, which are an oxide form. So in the oxide form, first it helps in uh, maintaining the OTs of the crop. First thing is that. Second thing, it helps to maintain the chlorophyll in the plant. Third thing is like where secondaries and tertiary, uh, treasuries will shoot up if you use potassium shonite. So I use it in every spray. So it gives a good result. Then complementing for potassium shonite, we are using magnesium sulphate, only 250 grams. Again, the results of magnesium sulphate is if there is any magnesium deficiency in Oh, I mean, out of 1000 plants, if 4 plants are suffering from magnesium deficiency, it will correct it so that we are going for 250 grams. Then we are using 50 <coughs> ml of Planofix. So out of all, what we have to uh, uh, concentrate on is, we have to use the lower molecules than making our plants addicted to the higher molecules. Once you have addicted your plants to the higher molecules, then it's, it's, I mean, your plants will get affected, I mean, uh, addicted to it. So, <coughs> from the beginning, we are just using Contof Chloro uh, with a little bit of nutrition management in it uh, to control the short hole borer. So, these are the few points which I wanted to show you. Now, coming back to the barrel here, see, mixing of the barrel is very important. So you, you should be keeping mixing it, so you have to mix up very, uh, I mean, regularly. So you have to, I mean, you have to assign one person to the barrel to mix it up. And more importantly, when we do our cocktails, within 8 minutes of time, the barrel should 
get discharged. So these are the few points where we have to keep in mind and these are the contents what we have to, I mean, uh, <coughs> what we are using it. Uh, people, uh, if you are using the same components, please comment on it or uh, like if you are using a different uh, components, please comment on it. So that like each and every, I mean like we can exchange our thoughts by your comments even I, I I can learn something from you people even you can learn from um, I mean something from me so this is the things which I wanted to share with you here you can see again the effects of short hole borer where the entire thing is gone so what quantum and chloro does is if there is any any damage in the running uh, reke or like a flow of the branch the uh, systemic uh, fungicide plays a very important role as a bandage for it and insecticide kills the uh, insect where the combination of fungicide and insecticide uh, is very vital the important point is see why we should control short hill borer is you just see here for the next crop we are ready with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and ninth is coming. So you can see the secondaries and treasuries opening up. So if, if the short hole borer is more and if we are using lot of urea, this entire thing will be gone because of the uh, where it comes to the tissues like this, damage it and bores it and come to the I mean this branch or this structure of the leaves so it will damage things so here also you can see here you can just check here this is the important things where so which is called as secondaries and treasuries and the next wood what we call as a next wood for the <coughs> for the crop of 2026 and 27 so these are the few things which we have to uh, give concentration on see here the openings of these leaves are very important what I call it as a butterflies you can just check here the butterflies here so the stream is flowing still a beautiful stream is flowing here So very important point is now we have to work on the treasuries, secondaries with the nutrition management with uh, as most of the people now talking about every every uh, a buyer is talking about the OTs uh, now there is a trend of specialty uh, coffee for the uh, for all that like potassium shonite is important to maintain a OT uh, and the, I mean uh, to to get the shine on the uh, crop one example you can just see this you can just see the knots here even though the crop is average the knots are very close by so these are the things what we have to concentrate much more you can just check here also how the knots are see how close by the knots are even the crops are average the knots should be close this are the genetic materials what I have spoken in my earlier videos like why you people should buy uh, <coughs> the genian seed material or genian plant agla agla karo ma bada niche se mar raha niche se mar raha hai ha the important point is uh, in uh, in uh, coffee plantation is you have to give adi in the kodbe kontare adi in the torse beko from assam labor gala now salpa you have to train it up and gira sutta barbe konta helbe adi in the kodto male male on sati torse beko I'm not going to
ಅಡಿಯಿಂದ ತೋರ್ಸ ಕೇಳಿ ಅವನಿಗೆ ಅಡಿಯಿಂದ ತೋರ್ಸ ಕೇಳಿ ಅಡಿಯಿಂದ ಹೊಡಸ್ತ ಅಲ್ವಾಮ್ಮ ಸೌಮ್ಯ ಹೇಳ್ತಾಲ್ವಾ ನೀನು ಅಡಿಯಿಂದ ತೋರಿಸ್ಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಸೊ ದೇ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಗುಡ್ ಪ್ರೆಷರ್ ಆಸ್ ವೆಲ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದೇ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಕಮ್ ಫಾಸ್ಟ್ ಕನ್ನಡದಲ್ಲಿ ಹೇಳಿ ಕೆಳಗಿಂದ ಒಂದ್ಸಲ ಇಡಿ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಮೇಲೆ ಇಂದ ಒಂದ್ಸಲ ಇಡ್ಬಿಡು ಅವನಿಗೆ ಕನ್ನಡ ಬರುತ್ತಲ್ವಾ ಹೇಳಿ ಮತ್ತೆ ಕೆಳಗಿಂದ ಒಂದ್ಸಲ ಇಡಿ ಕೆಳ ಕೆಳಗಿಂದ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಮೇಲೆ ಇಂದ ಒಂದ್ಸಲ ಹಿಂಸೋಸಿ ಸಾಕು ಸಾಕು ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಇಡಿಸ್ಬಾರ್ದು ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಎಳಿಬೇಡ ಸೌಮ್ಯ ಸೊ ಈವನ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ಲಾಂಟ್ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಸಿ ಹಿಯರ್ because of our nutrition management because of our proper uh, scientific uh, temperament and scientific uh, uh, things what we have done this year we have almost 1 to 2% of rotting you can just see here even in this plant the notch the crop size you can just see here and very important thing in the nutrition management how it helps is secondaries and tertiaries you can just see 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 almost it's ready so these are the few things we have to understand my plantation is a young plantation but still uh, what all we doesn't know we we, we are trying to uh, uh, gather the information uh, understand better to make a perfection in our stage so like we are also lacking behind in lot of things Uh, we should also learn a lot of things so this is the small thing which i wanted to show you so people uh, <coughs> please do not forget to like share uh, and uh, subscribe our channel please uh, press bell button to get more informations like this and uh, do not forget to comment uh, on the uh, <coughs> uh, short hole borer uh, thing how to control short hole borer and how to uh what, what to be done how to be done please do comment on uh, our chan- i mean on this blog so that like we can improve ourselves thank you one and all let's meet on the next blog uh, keep tuned so that like next blog will be uh, on how, what what uh, machineries we are using for the sprays w- what lances we using and what rubbers are using please do not forget to share like and uh, subscribe and to comment thank you let's meet on the next blog